There are a lot of achievements in EU4, and some people have them all. I am not one of them, but I plan to be. So, I put all 166 achievements that I have remaining onto a random wheel that will decide my next campaign. For each campaign, I'll create a standalone highlight video or guide until I've become an EU4 completionist. So, without further ado, let's spin the wheel and decide our next campaign. Alright boys, here we go. First spin. Oof. Give me the money. Give me the money. Come on. Okay. That's doable. That's a, that's a quick achievement. We can get that one easy. Let's go, boys. That's the first one. That's what we're doing. I'm excited. So for each of these videos, I'm going to go over a quick plan before we get into the run. Step one of this plan is A, ally the Ottomans. So this is super important since we need some defensive allies so that QQ doesn't obliterate us. Also, we're going to take advantage of the new Curry Favors mechanic in Leviathan. We need to get 10 favors and call our green friends into war as fast as possible in order to take to Breeze before somebody else might snap it up. For the achievement, we just need to Breeze and for Karakin Lu to not exist. So we're going to try to reset our truces after we take QQ out in the first war to shorten that truce timer in order to attack them in a second war and then if we need to, truce break them as well as feed land to other allies if we're struggling with AE or core creation cost. Otherwise, we need to rely on Ajam to take as much land as they possibly can. So if Ajam fails and gets beat by the Timurids, we might be out of luck. So those are the conditions for success here. Without further ado, let's get into the run. All right, boys, here it is. The first of many runs. All right, we're in. Let's look at our rivals. Belkadir, Trevisan, I don't care about going that direction unless I have a mission for it. So let's see. They want me to get rid of Zinkaifa. And then I get permanent claims. And then I get claims on this. All right, cool. So I have to hit Zinkaifa first. Perfect. We can do this. We do that. And then we're one away. So let's relations improve after a month. Uh, we have two other diplomats. So let's... We don't have a claim here. So... the core there? No. No, nothing. So we need a spy network on... Wait, actually, hold on. That'll never happen. Okay, spy network. First. On his and Kaifa. And take that. And that's good. We don't need to touch this anymore. For the rest of the campaign... I'm not going to bother. Okay, sex practices? Sure. Rivals? We'll match them. Do I have money? I do not have money. But we would guarantee. That's so nice of them. And now we have some friends. Cool. I'm going to keep improving with them, and then I'm going to start curring favors. And we're going to attack Kaifa. Hopefully he doesn't have good allies. Gizikamuk? We can handle Gizikamuk plus Hizikaifa. No problem. You going to tell me how fast we get this? 0.22 favors per month. Oh, that's actually really fast. Perfect. Okay. This, our leader is bad. Our heir is good. We make our leader the general. Take his and Kaifa. A little stack white Barino. And we need more troops because that's a level 3 fort. Let's build two. Let's go piece these guys out. And I can't get up there, can I? Well, this is just obnoxious. I'm stuck. I can't go and piece them out. Admin power. Um, I think it's important to be up on mill tech. We're going to focus mill. Okay, there we go. Now we're at 100. Finally, we can piece them out for money. And the province. Okay. Pour that up. Finish the mission. Permit claims on this whole area. Let's go. Okay. Now, autos. Wouldn't show them because they're in their own war. But otherwise they would. So let's wait for them to peace out Careman, and then we go in on these guys. All right, we just need four prov five provinces from them in the first war. And then after that, it's just making them weak enough that other people will attack them, possibly. That'll be good. It'll cut them right in half. And we'll have Tabriz and we'll be Gucci. There we go. Uh let's take Mosul as the war goal. Um, the Drylands Fort, get that easy. All right, Ottomans are in the war. 
not gonna be a problem. Attack me on the fort, really? Okay. Won two battles there, so I got two free siege ticks, which is nice on the mountain fort, and we got it at 14%. Nice. And the autos are gonna siege down muscle for us. Dryland's fort will fall quickly. If they attack me, I'm gonna be so upset. Please don't attack me on this fort. Like they're going to. Yeah. There's no morale advisors. That's sick. Can I win this? No. Ah, oh, that's right. We're assaulting it. Um. There we go. No. 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 Auto. 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 Help. 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 A jam. I need to get on to Breeze ASAP and occupy the stuff that I want. A jam's declaring an offensive war against them. That's what I want. I want them to be offensive and I want to Breeze. As long as I can occupy the right stuff and then a jam takes land from them, that's a best case scenario. Alright, let's peace out so that um, a jam can take all their land down here. Yep, yeah, get them out right away. That was their only ally. That's a whole state there as well. That's good. Um, they wouldn't dare. Not with the Ottomans at my back. Honestly, I'll reduce that twice in core. Um, and let's suppress rebels if possible. We're gonna have to fight them, I think. How much? How many? How much of the stacks are they? We don't have enough manpower to fight all these rebels, so. We're gonna have to increase the autonomy here. Oh, fort maintenance. Interesting. Let's delete this, because that's useless. It's in Kaifa's mountain. That's mountain. We don't need this fort. That's expensive. We'll keep Tabriz. That'll keep us, that'll make us a little bit cheaper. And we'll turn this off because no one's gonna attack us right now. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to full annex these guys. They need someone else needs to get to get them in a war. It's making me really nervous right now. I wanted to try and, and and shorten my truce with them. I don't know if that's going to work or not. Alright. Positive staff. I'm going to make some money. Do some admin, please. Yeah. Any universe where these guys are going to lose. I, God, I can't believe Ajam didn't take any land in that war. That is so obnoxious. Their truce is going to be up before mine. So, if I can just, like, have them fight QQ in this next war. Maybe I don't need a truce break. You know? It's going to be a very, very, very close war. We're going to need to peace out as fast as we can. We have until 78. Yeah, Jam's going on the Timrids, which they might end up losing that war. Okay, now Transoxianus will get war with the Timrids. No, they're at war with Ajam. They're at war with Uzbek, who's allied to Ajam. That sucks for me. Ottomans east out from Byzantium? They didn't take the province? Now they're going to war with Albania. Who's it? Allied to Venice. They're not going to join. If they don't join, this war's going to take so long. It always takes so long. Every time they do this. Oh my god. Ottomans, please. Why do you do this to me? Am I just going to go into debt and murk up? I might have to. There's no way I can get to this. There's no way, right? Yeah. So... What's an idea group that has some early bonuses? Defensive? Yep. Another war. Every single one of them. Every single one of them! He's out, please, for the love of God. I'm not going to be able to fight them on truce. On truce. Oh my God, everyone. Everyone get, getting their own shit done is so stupid. Peace them out. Just peace them out. Just peace them out. Auto, come on. I'm running out of time. Get the siege, please, for the love of God. Get the capital. What are you doing? What are you doing? Please. Please, just get their capital. Stop marching all the way. Marching into fog. There we go. Peace out, 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 peace out. You guys in your war exhaustion. Holy shit. No. Fuck you. I'm not doing that. Why? Why do you guys have to do this? You won't let you wouldn't join my wars, but I have to join your wars? That's so stupid. Ottomans are never gonna peace out. <sighs> 
All right. Here we go. Give me that morale. Sure, we'll take some extra dev. Everyone should attach to Crimean Company. Oh, what did they turn that fort on? Oh my goodness. There's a stack of white burino. I need, to, I need to beat them here. We have like four years to fight them, whip beat them, truce break them. My allies all decided to fight their own wars. I'm gonna restart. There's no way. I'd have to be able to truce break beat them in one war in four years. Uh, I can't. That's 1444, guys. It's just unfortunate. That's the way it is. Okay. Round two, we read over this, let's go. Okay, um, I've set up all the estates and my rivals. Let's roll Mary. Decent consort. Uh, we've put Spy Network on his Kaifa. That alliance offer and then three favors in February. Warned, we've been warmed. What? That's a, that's a 1444. So last time they guaranteed us, now they warn us. That's a 1444. All right, we go again. Roll marriage, dude. Come on, why can't we? Why can't we have a good game? All right, we'll start again. Spy network. We get the alliance on the 13th. Okay, and then we're going to curry favors. Warned, warned, warned. Okay, lovely. Chill. Speed five. God, damn it. Yes. No. Build two units. Every time now. Why did I get good luck the first time in order to get bad luck with my allies in their stupid wars? And now I can't go past March 1445 without being warned. I need to not be warned in order for this to work. All right, boys, let's go. Influenced by the Ottomans, I think this might be a ch I mean, we're past March. We might actually be able to do it. Son of a bitch. All right, we'll run it again. Okay, maybe this is the run now. April, they've not warned us. All I did was delay the spy network on Hissing Kaifa. Maybe that was what was triggering them to warn me right away. Um, and I didn't put any rivals, so I don't know if that's a factor as well. Okay, we haven't been warned. We can't fuck this up now. There's physically no way to get up there, so I have to sit on this until I can peace out, which is super annoying. But let's go down army maintenance. Now we're warned, but that doesn't matter though. It doesn't matter this time. We're just gonna declare on them next. Oh, repeats. Oh, okay, now we get 100%. Money. Okay, five, pass the mission. 46, claim, core, okay. Autos, hurry up. Need that extra morale, that's very important. And I think I'm going to focus mill now. Ajam declares war on Karkin Lu. Perfect timing. 1v1? Oh, Shivran joined though, okay. Ajam might get their butt beat, but this is perfect timing. Shivran now will join because they're in a war together. Oh, it's not mothballed anymore. Still got 160 garrison. We're gonna go for Yervin. I I think that's fine. Okay. That's a that's a really shame. Aja, I'm kinda ruined my plan, but it's whatever. Okay. Getting rid of their men. Oh yeah, get rid of the 7k. Yes, let's go. Okay. Once we're able to peace out, Ajam should have no problem beating them. 19k versus zero. They have nothing. Oh, that is so good. Alright, we're gonna peace out for 100 percent this whole state? Yeah, we do that instead. Okay. Reduce war exhaustion. For that. Thank you, autos. Now, Ajam, please, please win the war. I will love you forever if you just take land. And as much as you possibly can, just take all of it. Literally what this comes down to is Ajam winning against him. Because last time he did not win. At all. Can I even use any of these claims? I can take claim ticket. Yep, that's it. But you should, they really need to go and get their forts back. Okay, they got that fort back. They're going to march onto their capital. Nice. Better air. Let's go. Better ruler. All right. Now we can take these clicks. Boom. And we are, we're already at plus one stab from an event earlier. So that's really good. Get your capital back, please. Thank you. Good siege rolls. If he's out, Shivrin. Let's go. Again, 28%. Win it, win it, win it, win it. 42. Don't peace out before you reoccupy your capital. Come on. Take more. You were so close. You were so close. Yes! You released Bitless. Let's go! Okay. Alright, All right, let's look. 101! 101! 
No! QQ oh Ajam, you idiots! You idiots, Ajam! You stupid idiots! <laughs> oh my gosh. When's my truce? 71. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Um again, delete these forts. They're awful. That one we can keep. That one, we'll get rid of that one. And that one. We only need the two. I don't really think any more is necessary. It's just too expensive. Okay, we became a lot stronger. 15% bonus modifier on our morale. Stacking with our traditions here. We have probably the highest morale in the game. I would almost bet on it. Let's check. There we go. Now we're the highest morale in the game. <laughs> Guaranteed. Rentaxion has a really high morale, actually. Do they have defensive ideas as well? No. Oh. All right, boys. Truce is expired. One day, Ottomans are putting in another war, but they're going to finish that one quickly and they'll probably still be able to call, accept my call to arms. We'll make this our war goal. Perfect. Let's slow it down. Don't want to get too hasty. Ottomans will accept now. I don't know why it said they wouldn't before. And now they're in this war as well. We spent a decent amount of time improving uh, trust with them uh, in the downtime, so that's probably why they accepted. All right, got the maneuver on my generals, plus the extra leader shock. So if we roll another general, or put our leader as a general, he might actually have pre-coded stats to be like this. I'm not going to lie, because that's what we got last time. Okay, peace with Shivrin. Um, we're going to null your treaties with QQ. I just want to make sure that people are incentivized to attack them. Um, and then I'll take your money and I guess war reps for now. And now we've 100%ed QQ. We can, so the current peace deal releasing Iraq, we're not able to 100% them again still. So, I mean, we take these provinces and we just leave this. What train is this? Grass, okay, good. Easy for people to take. Do you have a claim on it? Yes, do you have a claim on it? No, but you might. Gotta do it. Let's core it up. Um, worst case scenario, if these guys don't go to war with... Um, when's their truce up? June? For this next June. If they don't go to war with uh, QQ and fully annex them, then we'll truce break. It's all up to Mishasha now. Apparently, Ajam doesn't want anyone to have them, so they've guaranteed. Um, we're going to... We're going to declare war on these guys. I won't accept. Mm, they won't accept. Okay. What did you put your money into, dude? I just gave you money. What did you put it into? Did you pay off your debt? Off your stupid debt. Come on. I don't care. Take more money. Pay off your debt. I just gave you way more than your than what you have in debt. Another hundred. Okay. Dude. Do you not want to pay off your debt? I give him like 200 gold. 200 ducats and he's not paying off his debt. What are you doing with that money? Are you building? Come on. I literally only have three years left. You need to pay off your debt. They have 371 ducats. They're not paying off their debt. Maybe if I subsidize them? Offer them subsidies. Okay. Okay. Yes. That did it. Stressful. Two years. Two years. We have to hurry up. Give me a siege. Three siege. Let's go. The siege might take two years, dude. Nice. Let's go. Okay. Almost. Come on. We can do it, guys. We're so close. He's locked in, Koi. Good. We got him. Okay. We did it. We did it. Oh my god, that was so stressful. I don't know why these guys would want to get it. It's because they rivaled us. That's the only reason. It's because they rivaled us. They could have they they taken it easy. All right. Boom. We got the achievement. There it is. Rise of the White Sheep. Okay, boys. That took a, a lot longer than I thought it would. That uh, shenanigans with the warning was a little annoying, but... You know, actually, pretty easy achievement when it came down to it. A little stressful at the end because of the war score cost to annex them. Um, but we were able to do it. So, that's uh, Rise of the White Sheep. Alright, here goes. For the next campaign. Let's spin the wheel.
That's not bad either. Let's do that one. 